वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू आई थिंक यू मे ऑल आर फाइन राइट ऑल ऑफ यू स्टे होम स्टे सेफ लर्न वेल ओके स्टूडेंट्स इन प्रीवियस क्लास वी हैव लैंड इनवर्टी ब्रेड्स एंड वर्टी ब्रेड्स राइट इनवर्टी ब्रेड्स आर एनिमल्स विदउट बैक बोन्स वर्टी ब्रेड्स आर एनिमल्स विथ बैक बोन्स राइट these invertebrates can be further divided into five groups reptiles birds amphibians mammals and fish okay so these animals live in wide range of habitats the diverse habitats have different conditions and after different challenges the body features and behavior of animals help to live and survive in its habitat okay so let us see how okay students in this class i am going to teach you body coverings of animals okay animal body coverings the body coverings of animals provide them protection or help them adjust to the environment okay let us study the body coverings of different kinds of animals students now we are going to know body coverings of insects okay insects are invertebrates okay so these insects are without backbones insects do not have a backbone they have a hard outer covering that protects and supports their body okay students now we are going to know body coverings of reptiles okay reptiles are vertebrates right animals with backbones okay so these reptiles are crawl on land and lay hard shelled eggs they have dry scaly skins right example for these reptiles or crocodile snakes and lizards are some examples for reptiles reptiles are vertebrates okay animals with backbones reptiles such as crocodiles have their bodies covered with dry hard scales such scales prevent water loss from their bodies a tortoise is a reptile that as a hard shell on its body a tortoise moves very slowly the hard shell provides it protection from predators when a tortoise senses danger it pulls its head and legs inside the shell snakes are also a reptiles snakes periodically mold or shed their scaly skins and acquire new ones this is called molting molting permits replacing of old worn out skin with a new one and allows the snake to grow the arrangement of colorful scales to identify different types of snakes so this is all about body coverings of reptiles students now we are going to know body coverings of birds birds have feathers and lay hard shelled eggs most birds can fly right only few of the birds like emu ostrich penguin hen they can't fly because of their heavy body weight okay some of the common birds like pigeon crow sparrow parrot okay these are all some examples for common birds birds have their bodies covered with feathers right they have three types of feathers flight feathers contour feathers and down feathers feathers help birds to fly and to keep warm they are of different colors and shapes they are light and 
get strong so all the feathers on a bird's body are not the same different kinds of feathers have different uses flight feathers are large they are found in the tail and wings of a bird they help a bird to fly and contour feathers cover the body of a bird and give it shape and down feathers grow close to the body of a bird they keep the bird warm okay they are fluffy and help birds to remain warm students next we are going to know body coverings of fishes fishes are also vertebrates they have backbone okay these fishes live only in water and lay soft shelled eggs most of the fish have overlapping scales on their bodies these scales protect their soft bodies these scales are flexible and do not disturb their movement okay students next we are going to know body coverings of mammals mammals also a vertebrates they have backbone okay mammals give birth to young ones and have hair and external ears examples for some mammals are cows dogs whales dolphins and humans are some examples of mammals a mammal's body is covered with fur hair wool or bristles okay these body coverings keep the animals warm in cold climate and also protect them from rain students in this class we have learned body coverings of different animals right if you have any doubt ask in online session all of you should follow given worksheet thank you students